guys in this mini course we will going to teach you how you can create one acrium website very easily so you can see that this is a acrium website which we have created very simple very super and very attractive so to create this website we have used all the free resources that means you will going to use all the free plugins and themes to make this website along with that this mobile is 100% mobile desktop and tablet friendly we will going to teach you step by step how you can create this website very easily okay so you can see this is a website which we have created now if you want to go to home page just go to home page this is how home page will going to look like you can totally customize it you can change text image whatever you want to do you can do that very easily you can click on read blogs so you it will be redirected to read blogs where your website visitors can read blogs you will going to publish inside this website if your website visitors want to contact you they can contact you you can put your blog link here okay so it's totally customizable i will teach you everything how you can do that one uh, step by step from scratch then you have this blog button so in blog we have just put some demo blogs here you can put more blogs and you can write about blogs we have also taught or given you resources how to uh, write blogs so that is another 40 minutes video we have provided that uh, inside this course we will teach you how you can access it okay for free and then you you have this about the section where you can just write about your brand about your website okay so it's very simple so you can see this is your website you can talk about your team you can put your signature you can put your image here so we will teach you how you can do that then you you have this contact us so people can contact you you have provided your location us contact us you have also provided your social icon so people can contact you through your social uh, through your social channels so this is a thing which we have told you and here is your map so people can visit your office as, uh, office as well so this is a basic but very cool website we will going to teach you inside this mini course how you can build one okay so you can just click on this logo so you can again come to your uh, home page of your website okay so guys to make any website you require domain as well as hosting so choosing right hosting is very much important for your website so in my case i have chosen domain racer so you can just go to this website domain racer.com i have provided the link of this website in below description box so you can just check it out okay so you can see that this is very amazing hosting why because it is very much affordable they have 99% uptime it will going to make your website 300% uh, faster they have a high computing power and they are also uh, going to provide you free SSL so you can see that in if, if you will going, going to visit to any website uh, you will see this uh, log so this is SSL that is SSL certificate if in your website you don't have SSL so it will going to show not secure so when someone will going to visit your website and if they will going to see not secure in your website so they will going to leave your website immediately so it's very much important to have ssl certificate in your website so this, so this company will going to actually provide you free ssl okay so they have very light speed technology they will going to provide you cloud-based ssd service and there are many more okay so you can see they have various plans so you can just take uh, their plan so after you will take this hosting so you will be able to create websites easily along with that they have lots of amazing features like they will going to provide you their website builder and many more things so that will going to make your life very much easy okay so you can see there are many features they provide at very low price like backups website content manager like wordpress hosting management and and many more they will going to provide you their seo premium tool as well so there are many features so just take this hosting and then we will be able to build our website so you can see that we will going to use wordpress as a content management so if you don't know how to buy this hosting and how to install wordpress inside this hosting so i have also provided the link in below description of this video so just check that link as well so with the help of this video you can easily buy and install wordpress inside domain racer okay so you can see right now i'm inside wordpress dashboard so now guys before we proceed further i just want to provide you resources so you can see that we have provided you this folder so inside this folder you will going to see all the important documents that will going to help us to make this website very easily and we will be able to create this website very fast so you have to download these resources so actually these resources you will going to form you will going to find in the form of zip file so when you will download 
this file so you will going to see this file under your uh, computer downloads if you are a window user so you can just go to my computer and then you can just go to download but if you are a mac user so you can just open finder and click on and click on downloads so when you will see this zip file which is here so what you simply need to do is that you need to double click so when you will double click so one folder will be generated so inside this folder you will only going to see all the files and images that will going to help us to make this website okay so you can just drag it to your desktop if you want to okay so please download this zip file and unzip and inside this you will be able to find these resources okay also uh, if you are a window user so just right click and then you will see one option of extract but if you are a mac user so just double click it will automatically going to open this folder okay so now we are finally in our wordpress website so now guys we have to do some basic settings and we have to see the overview of our uh, wordpress website so right now when you will click on screen options so you will see there are a lot of things which is not required so you can just untick all of them so it will going to go and it will make your website look very clean so then you have this post area so from here you can just create blog articles and then you have this media option so from here you can just upload your photos and images then you have pages that will going to help us to build our website then comments people who will going to comment on your website they will going to show up here then you have this appearance here you can just change the look of your website plugins help us to add features inside your website then you have users with the help of users you can easily uh, add users to your website then you have tools and then you have settings so just click on this general tab so here you can just change your website name and everything like that and from membership make sure you click on anyone can register and then you have to just scroll down and you have to click on save changes and then you have to go to writings so here you just don't need to do anything just go to readings so in readings also you don't have to do anything then just directly go to permalinks and from here just choose to post name in your case it might be something else but you have to make sure that you have to choose this post name option and then scroll down and click on save changes so guys in this way we have done all the uh, basic wordpress settings then click on dashboard so now guys uh, we have to install plugins so to install plugins you can just go here and just click on add new button so from here guys uh, you have to install plugin like you can just search for elementor e-l-e-m-e-n-t-o-r elementor you can just search for this elementor then just click on this install now button so this will going to help us to customize our website uh, very easily okay so after you will uh, do this let's uh, install it first of all okay so just wait it is taking time but let's wait so this uh, builder will going to help us to make our <coughs> website okay so let's wait for it to install So you can see guys uh, we have installed the elementor then just click on this activate button so that you can just activate this uh, elementor builder so it will going to take you some take you to some other page okay so from here uh, you just do not need to do uh, anything you just need to click on um, create my account or just click on this skip button again just click on this skip button again just click on skip again click on this skip button again click on this uh, escape button okay so after you will uh, escape everything it will take you to the elementor page so if you are getting confused what we are doing so actually just follow the steps which i am doing so from here you can just click on this top menu uh, lines then click on exit to dashboard okay so after you will uh, do this just uh, wait so you will going to go to uh, go to your wordpress uh, dashboard then from top you will see this uh, WordPress logo icon so just follow my cursor so just tap here so it will again uh, take you to the WordPress builder so guys in this uh, way you will again go to your uh, dashboard so from here you just need to click on this dashboard button so guys in this way we have successfully 
install this plugin again click on screen options you can just untick it to make your website or wordpress dashboard look clear okay so now guys uh, we will going to install important theme so to install theme just go to appearance click on themes now themes will going to help you to make your website look different okay so according to your need you have to choose right theme okay so just click on this add new button so from this add new button just search for ocean that is o c e a n ocean so after you will search for ocean you will come to this uh, ocean wp so just click on install So it may take some uh, amount of time but still uh, let's wait it will not going to take more than two minutes actually okay so just wait for it to install so you can see that right now it is installed then just click on this activate button so you can see right now ocean wp is activated now if you will hover over your my blog or whatever you will see here you will see visit site just right click click on open link in a new tab so this is how your website is looking right now okay so uh, you have successfully installed the theme now what you can do you can just go to your dashboard so now guys uh, we have to create some important pages that can help us uh, to create uh, our website okay so just go to pages click on all pages so now when you will click on all pages so here you will see a lot of pages which are useless so you just need to click on this uh, title this top so automatically all will be selected you can untick this privacy policy because we require this policy poli uh, privacy policy page in our website so click on this bulk action click on move to trash click on apply so you can just delete uh, this pages so now it is in trash if you will click on trash again click here now click on bulk action click on delete permanently click on apply so you can see that you have successfully deleted all the pages if you will see any of these notifications so just close it and after that click on this add new button now we have to create some important pages that will going to help us uh, to build this uh, website so first click on or right here home then you just need to click on publish button click on publish after you will do this you just have to click on this wordpress logo from top left again click on add new button after you will click on add new button here you just need to write blog or blogs whatever you want click on publish click on publish after you will do this again just go to your wordpress uh, logo or click on wordpress logo again click on add new button and you have to create more two pages so one will be contact us so this page will going to help us uh, to get connected with our website visitors so if in case your website visitors want to contact with uh, contact with us so they can just go to this contact us page and they can contact uh, to us okay so just click on publish click on publish again again click on this uh, wordpress logo and from here just click on add new button once again so after you will do this here you need to write about us then click on publish click on publish so this about us page will going to help uh, our visitors to know about our website in depth okay so again just go to your wordpress uh, logo click on wordpress logo so you have uh, so you can see that we have successfully created all the important pages that will going to help us to build our website now you just need to go to settings and from settings click on reading so click on reading button from here you have to uh, tell your wordpress dashboard that what is your home page and blog page so just click on a static page and from home page select uh, home and from post page you have to select blogs so now you have told uh, your wordpress that my home my home page is this home page my post page is this blog page which we have just now created okay then click on save changes after you will do this if you will see this notice so just click on this dismiss this notice and then make sure you click on save changes and then just go to your dashboard so guys in this way we have successfully uh, created pages for our website and we have connected our pages to the respective important pages settings okay now guys we have to create menus so my creating menus are very much important so you can see that menus are this top section that we're going to display here like this okay so you also have to create that menus for your uh, website as well so just go to appearance and from appearance click on menus 
So after you will click on menus, here you will see one option of create menu. So you can just write here main menu, main menu. Okay. So after you will do this, just click on this create menu button. So after you will click on this create uh, menu button, you have to click on this view all and you have to select all the pages which we have just created. Click on add to menu. So you have to make sure that home is in very top blogs and about us then contact us even you can drag it uh, like this okay so make sure that they are arranged uh, in this way then just click on save menu so guys in this way we have also created our menus so now you can just simply go to your wordpress dashboard okay now guys we have to do some customized setting in our uh, wordpress dashboard so now you can just go to let's say appearance and from here you will see this customize button so just right click click on open link in a new tab so you will see one new tab will be open so you have to open that tab and here you will see this customize settings okay so from here you just need to first of all uh, go to general options just go to general options and from here you can just click on this page title and from the visibility you can choose hide on all devices okay click on publish button now click on this cross button okay so when you will do this uh, it will again take you to the wordpress dashboard now just go to appearance click on menus also make sure that you select this uh, main option here and just click on save menu okay so we have successfully done all the necessary customization even if in future if we want to add some more customization we will come to this customize tab and we will going to customize our website okay but right now we do not require uh, anything like that just click on dashboard okay so we will going to customize our website okay so it's very easy just go to uh, this option of pages click on all pages so when you will click on all pages so first is this home page which you can see so you just need to right click on your edit button open it in a new tab click on open in a new tab so it will be to open uh, your home page in a new tab so from here you just need to click on this edit with elementor button which you can see at very top so just tap there and after you will do this so elementor page builder will going to open so from here you will see that uh, very bottom left you will going to see one gear icon where it shows settings click on that seti settings button from page layout you have to select elementor full width okay so now you can see this is how your menus and everything will going to show up here so after you will do this click on this update button so now guys you can see that this is your uh, page and you have to customize it okay so we have already provided you templates so you have to choose the template so you have to uh, click on this add template button click on this add template button and from here you have to choose uh, my template so here you will see this button of import template click on select file and here in the folder which uh, which we have told you to download so there inside that folder we have provided you this home.json so you have to just uh, select this click on open so it will be selected then you have to click on enable and import okay so this will going to import all the home page so after you will do this click on this insert button so it will going to insert the home page for you so you can see that to almost all the thing is here so you have to just click on this six dots here at very top when you will click on these six dots just go to style select image and from upload file just select upload files you have to click on select files go to images and from here just choose this first one click on open so it will going to insert this image inside uh, your website so let's wait okay so almost done so after you will do this here at very bottom uh, right you will see this insert media so just click on that insert media so you will be able to see that you have uh, put this uh, image uh, in your website like this okay so this is how amazing it will going to look okay so it's super simple to do then just scroll down click on this pencil button here okay so you will again going to see this image option click on choose image go to upload file select the file and choose now second image okay so after you will select the second image just wait for few uh, seconds so that it will be uploaded then you will see the insert media option click on insert media so again the second image will be uploaded okay now just uh, do one thing here whatever customization you have to do it's very easy guys for example if you want to change this green nature into your 
home so you can just click here so you will see you will going to get this setting so if you want to change it to house so you can see it will change to house okay so it's super simple to customize uh, this uh, page if you want to do some changes here just tap here it will going to tell you everything so from here you can just customize it okay same with buttons if you will tap on this button so here you can just provide your links and anything uh, you want okay so for example uh, here instead of shop now i want to show let's say uh, read blogs okay and in learn more i just want just tap on learn more and from here i just want to show uh, contact us okay now guys you have to provide links uh, to these pages so it's very easy just go to pages section of your wordpress then here you will see this contact us right click on view open it in a new tab so you will see your contact us page will be going to open don't worry we will going to customize it first of all just copy the link right click click on copy go to your elementor page and select this contact us first of all and here you will see the link option just remove whatever you will going to see here right click click on paste so we have successfully pasted uh, our contact us page link similarly cross this page and then uh, from here you can just choose this blog page so just right click on view open it in a new tab again you will see your website's blog link so just select them all right click click on copy go to your elementor home select this read blogs button here you will see whatever uh, below link just remove it right click click on paste so you have pasted the link of your blogs okay just click on update button so you have successfully updated it that means whenever someone will try to click on read blogs they will go to your blog uh, page but the read blog page or if they will click on contact us so they will go to your contact us page so similarly uh, here you can just write whatever you want okay so it's totally customizable we have put image even if you want to change image you can just click on this pencil button from here you can choose whatever uh, image you want okay so after you will do this write anything you want click on learn more learn more button you can uh, write any of your blog and you can copy the link of your blog and you can paste it okay so it's very uh, simple to do as i have told you okay so in this way you can just write your achievements and everything like that it's totally customizable if you will click on our achievements it will going to show our achievements if you will click on this uh, pencil button so it will going to show you 89 so if you will put number prefix one so it will going to show one in front if you do if you don't want anything so you can just click on 89 okay so it's totally up to you uh if you want to add plus so you can see this plus will always be visible here so i just want to add here one so in this way you can just change the numbers and everything then click on update button so guys in this way you can see that we have successfully uh created our home page now to go to your dashboard you just need to click on this uh menu bar and then you have to click on exit to dashboard so that you can just go to uh, your dashboard area and then from here you can just click on your wordpress logo at very top left you will going to see your wordpress logo just click here so that you can just go to your dashboard okay so guys in this way we have created our home page so now guys similarly we have to uh, create our contact us and about us so just uh, right click on edit of about us open it in a new tab so similarly we have to use elementor to build our about us page so just uh, click on this edit with elementor button so that it will be to open uh, elementor page builder for uh, you guys okay so it's super simple so after you will do this just go to bottom click on this gear button from here you have to choose the page layout again to elementor full width after you will do this click on this update button now again click on this folder and from the folder go to my templates and click on this uh, import template click on select file and from here uh, just go to the folder which we have provided you from here uh, you can just select this about us okay so it will going to insert complete about us for you guys in your website so you will see this about us click on insert button click on apply so it will going to import uh, everything about a section so you can similarly customize it the way you want okay so you can see that you have put uh, these images and everything like that okay so it's totally a uh, customizable website okay just click on this update button once and make sure you again just refresh it in case if uh, it's face any kind of issue so we can just get rid of that issue, issue okay so here again just click on this button and from page layout again just choose to elementor full width first of all 
okay now it is looking great click on update button so guys you can just customize again everything uh, you want for example my ex an experience you can just write your experience meet our team you can just put your image here as well if you want to okay you can see meet our team here you can just put your image uh, if you have any of the image so you can just put it here you can put the signature as well okay so it's totally up to you uh, however you want to customize it uh, you can do it so to change your image you can just go to this area go to style and from here you can put your image whatever uh, image you want and you can put that image over here okay uh, your image so guys in this way you have uh, put your about us and you can just write uh, whatever you want then uh, click on this nine menu button click on exit to dashboard so we have created about us so similarly we have to just create our contact us so just again click on this wordpress logo from top left then you will see this contact us right click on edit button open it in a new tab so you can see that uh, right now we will going to customize our contact us click on edit with uh, elementor so after you will do this it will going to open uh, edit uh, contact us elementor page from this gear settings go to page layout make it to elementor full width okay and after it will be done just click on this update button again click on this folder button go to my templates choose this uh, upload import option select file and right now just select this contact us click on open so it will select the contact us okay so now you can see this contact will going to show here click on this insert button so that you can insert uh, your total uh, contact us page okay so you can see here you you can put one image so just click on this uh, six dots go to style choose image click on upload file select file and from here we have provided you this contact uh, page in the resources folder so just tap that and after you will do this click on this uh, insert media so you will be able to see that contact image here so here you can customize it like if you want to customize location you can write it here whatever you want if you will click on this pencil button you can just write your location where your office is located in which time you guys uh, work if you want to change some contact as detail you can just put your phone number here for example my phone number is okay you can put your email address so people can contact you then here is your social icons just click on these social icons and here you can see right now facebook so if you will see my facebook uh, wait let me show you my facebook is being facebook dot uh, being commerce official we have tons of followers here so you guys can also uh, follow us hundred thousand plus followers we have in our page you can see uh, you can see here okay so just go to your social profile just copy the link like this right click click on copy go to your elementor page and here click on this facebook tap on this link right click click on paste so it, you will successfully be able to paste your facebook link so whenever someone will click on this facebook logo uh, logo they will be able to go to your facebook page so similarly you can put the twitter link of yours youtube links of yours and many more if you don't want pinterest to so just cross it okay then just click on this update button so guys in this way you have also put your uh, contact us page also one more thing just click on this pencil button of map here you can write the address uh, where you are located so it will automatically going to populate the map okay so this was the thing i want to tell you just click on these three doors click on exit to dashboard so guys we have successfully uh, done most of the part of our video click on this wordpress logo so you can just go and uh, go to your wordpress dashboard so from here just click on this dashboard button okay so so now guys we will going to add blogs uh, to our website so just go to post click on add new so from here these sections you can just add blogs uh, very easily so for example uh, this will be blog okay that is related to the uh, beautiful fish in the world something like this okay so just the demo uh, blog to show you just go to featured image click on featured image click on upload file select files and from here we will going we have provided you this aquarium website here just go to images click on uh, blogs select the first image okay so here you can see that uh, uh, we have just put this uh, fish just click on uh, set featured uh, image so here you can just write some text okay so 
what I will do, I will just put some demo text here. But this lecture is not about uh, teaching you how to write blogs. So I'm just putting here some demo text. Okay, so for example, let's put uh, this much of uh, demo text here. Okay, so just just put it man complete. Okay, so click on add new post. So here just put some article like this. Okay, so you can see uh, this is how uh, it will going to uh, look. So you can see uh, this is how you can create blogs and you can write blogs. If you don't know how to write blog, I have again uh, pasted one link with this lesson that will going to teach you how to write blogs perfectly so that you can get free traffic from google to your website okay so just check out that video that video will be very much helpful for you uh, to build uh, or write your perfect blog so after you will do this just click on this publish button as well you can also put categories for your blog if you want okay so click on publish publish so in this way you have published the post so similarly go to uh, WordPress logo you will see that the post which we have just now created you can just uh, delete this demo one click on trash and from trash you can delete it permanently and then you can just click on add new to uh, add more and more blocks to your website so again just just let me put the same uh, paragraphs and everything like this so this is just a demo okay so I'm not uh, going to teach you how to add blogs but just uh, writing something click on post so that our website looks uh, great so just click on select files select the second block image like this and let's wait for it to be uploaded so just wait and then just and then you will going to see this set featured uh, image option so just click here so it will going to uh, add the image click on publish click on publish so similarly add one more again click on this wordpress logo you have to click on this add new button to add one more block okay so this is just a demo blocks which i am uh, adding okay okay so when so just wait uh, so you can see this is how uh, your blocks will going to show okay in your uh, website so you can just copy the title just paste the same title here okay click on this publish button click on this publish button okay so you can see guys we have successfully added blocks as well in our website click on this dashboard so guys in this way you can add blogs and as i have told you uh, if you want to add blogs in your uh, website and if you want to know how to write blogs i provided the link attached with this lesson that will going to teach you to uh, write perfect blogs in your website okay so now guys uh, let's customize uh, this complete website and this will be the last step so just go to appearance go to customize right click click on open it in a new tab so now we will just do some final touch up in our website like putting logos and everything like that okay so it's a very uh, easy topic so there are many settings we will just go to all of the settings in one by one in very uh, fast way okay so just click on site ident identity you can write the name also you can select your logo so in case if i upload my logo so for your company uh, if you have any logo so you can just put your logo uh, there as well okay so this is our logo so we will going to place our logo we will select the logo we will click on skip cropping so you can see that in my website it will going to show my logo and here you can just write aquarium okay or like say green aquarium okay so you can just write uh, things like this click on uh, publish button you can even write the the aquarium world click on publish go back and then choose color so here you can you don't have to do anything go back from menus you can see that this is your current menu which is showing no problem then go to widgets so from here you don't have to do anything home page settings so from home page settings you don't have to do anything then just go to typography uh, in typography go to general first of all okay so here also you don't have to do anything go to general options and click on general styling and primary color is blue so we want it to make it to green color okay so as per our theme you can see that this is how uh, it will going to show let's make it more dark so this is how uh, it will going to look now okay so you can choose your primary color from here go back go to general settings in general settings uh, do we have to do anything uh, no we don't have to do anything you can choose uh, let's say this this page like this okay and from layout you don't have to do anything 
okay just go back page title uh, nothing to do here a scroll to top that means this button uh, you can see that this is a button that that is a scroll to top if you want to change you can just change it from here as well then uh, nothing to do here okay nothing to do here then just go to blog go to blog here so here you will see when you will click on this blog so this is how uh, your blog will going to look like so you can just customize the entries for example if you will choose this one so this is how it will going to look if you will put this so this is how the layout template will going to look like of your blog okay so it's totally up to you uh, whatever uh, you want to show so you can just show it if you don't want to uh, show comments or author you can just untick it okay so it's simple you can also select this one so let's see how it will going to look okay so this will going to look like this let's select this one let's see how it will going to look okay so whatever uh, layout you love i will go with this one okay which is this one so just click on this publish button go back go to single post so from single post if you will click any of your article let's open this article so this was the article so how you want this layout to be so just select any layout uh, you want so you can choose this one now let's also select uh, this one so you can see this is how uh, your your uh, image will going to show at very top then you have to write about your blog then next articles will going to show up here like this click on publish go back go back then from header just go to general uh, here you will see the height so you can just increase or decrease it it's totally up to you okay so do you want anything to do here no just go back go to logo uh, here you can also put your logo as well if you want so for example if i will choose my logo here so i can also show my logo click on skip cropping so you can see that i can also show my logo just drag it so you can see that my logo should be uh, this much okay so this is uh, enough for a logo then click on publish go back go to menus and here you don't have to do anything okay uh, width you can just increase the width uh, of your uh, this head headings okay so here you do you just don't need to do anything center center will not look that much great also even uh, you can do center as well it's totally up to you guys okay if, if you want to put to left right or wherever you want uh, you can just do that i will go with right only and then uh, you will going to see more options so here uh, you will not going to see any such options okay so just go back and go to social menu don't enable it if you want you can also enable it so what will going to happen uh, your social menus will also going to show up okay so i don't want that just go back again go back and then just click on this top bar go to general and disable this top bar so this top section will going to disable okay click on publish go back go back and guys there is nothing uh, to do here okay so this was the thing guys also just go to sidebar once and okay so there also nothing to show so guys in this way you have done all the basic customization just click on this cross button now if you will visit your website just visit your website so this is how your website will going to look like okay very simple super green okay like this people can read blogs like this okay if someone will click on read blog so they will go to your blog page and they can read all your blogs which you will going to publish to your website if you will click on your logo or home button you will again go to your home page if you will click on contact us so you can just go to your contact us page where your website visitors can contact you okay you can again go to home so this in this way guys you can create your Ethereum website